let's do trip two. So Wednesday, I went shopping at Walmart and got pretty much majority of everything I would need to finish up the cannonball bonus, except I think like I need five, five or six more items to get that. So I'm gonna let a few things reset and go back. I did, I'm kind of happy I got some like food pantry items because I don't want, well, I mean, I guess I've done the spaghetti a few times. Um, Super excited that the Gatorade like energy protein bars and things came back because my uh, nephews really love them. Okay, so I did the American Beauty pasta. I was kind of thrown off. I was like, when I saw this, uh, there was like one of these left and I was thrown off by their new packaging. But yeah, so uh, these are $1.18 each. I got the spaghettis. I bought two of them. It's $2.36 out of pocket when you buy them. I bought it has a dollar back when you buy two of them, making them $1.36 or just 68 cents each. Okay, so I did Best Foods mayonnaise. This is $3.48. I had a dollar coupon from the $3.19 Retail Me Not. So I paid $2.48. I got back 75 cents from Ibotta, and then I got back, I had a 75 cent from Fetch Rewards, and then like, somewhere like a five point thing. So it ended up being like 80 cents back from Fetch Rewards, making this 30 ounce jar of mayonnaise just 93 cents. So that's a super good deal on Best Foods mayonnaise. I did the old El Peso Toco Shields. Um, not actually a big fan of like prepackaged taco shells. We usually make our own. These are $1.74 each. I bought two of them. There's a dollar off of two coupon from coupons.com. So I paid $2.48 out of pocket for the both of them. And I bought it has 50 cents back on each one. So that's a dollar back. And then I had a dollar off of two from Saving Star, making these 48 cents or 24 cents each. Super awesome deal on taco shells. Next is the Gatorade Chews. These are a dollar each. There's a 50 cent rebate back on Ibotta, making it just 50 cents. And then when you also buy the Gatorade uh, protein bar, which is $1.48, you pay that out of pocket, get 50 cents back, making it just 98 cents. When you buy these together, there is a bonus, a 50 cent bonus on these. So that's a super good deal when you buy two of these. And then I did the Sour Punch Bites again. These are a dollar. There's a 55 cent rebate back on it, making it just 45 cents. So I did these Suave Professionals. This is actually not that great a deal. But like I said, when you, um, and this is one of those other bonuses, when you buy two Suave products, you get an additional bonus. So that's why I did it. These are, this is $2.94 um, for the Suave Professional Shampoo. I paid that $2.94. I bought it, had a dollar back on it. And then... Fetch Rewards had 50 cents back on it. Fetch Rewards with the Swab products were like, it was like 500 points, 250 points, 24 points. Like, it was just like, bam, bam, bam. Swab is like hot on Fetch Rewards right now. Um, So that ended up being $1.44. But I also got the Swab deodorant. This is $1.50. There's a 50 cent rebate back on it, making it on Ibotta, making it just a dollar. But when you buy them together, there was a 50 cent bonus. And I got points back on Fetch Rewards for the Swap deodorant as well. So when you buy these together, they like end up being a decent price. So they kind of end up being about 97 cents. Um, each a little less because I didn't take in count that um, I was going to get back additional points on Fetch Rewards for this. But still, when you buy two Suave products on Ibotta, you get 
a bonus. And then on Fetch Rewards, I did not see it either, but when you buy three, you get additional. So when I go back, I'm gonna get another Suave product. I'm thinking like Suave Hairspray or like the Suave Kids two-in-one or like $1.88 each. And, and then when I get another um, bonus through Fetch Rewards for buying them, all three products. So I did the Purcell again, $4.94, $2 coupon, $2.94 out of pocket, $2 back from my bottom, making it just 94 cents. Did the Motrin again, $3.98, $3 coupon, pay 98 cents out of pocket. My bot is giving you back $8.50, making this a 52 cent moneymaker. Don't mean to be like super rushed through it, but I did just talk about them. All right, I did secret body cleansing wipes. I'm actually, the other day I saw a commercial for like deodorant wipes and I was like, what? Um, but these are $2.97, you pay, sorry. These are $2.97, you pay that out of pocket. There's a $2 back rebate on Ibotta, making it just 97 cents for 15 wipes. Okay, I did this Tampax deal. Look at these boxes. They are like thrashed. Um, but they were like the last two of these uh, at Walmart. And it ends up being actually a really good deal for these tampons. So the Tampax Pocket Radiant are $3.97 each. I used a dollar, used two dollar coupons that came in the PG, uh, the June PG. So I paid at $5.94 out of pocket for them. So a little high out of pocket. But I bought it has $2 back for each one. So that's $4 back. Uh, making it $1.94 for the both of them or just $0.97. Cents. And whenever I could get tampons for under a dollar. Actually, whenever I get tampons for like $1.50 or less, I'm super excited. So that was the last thing. So we'll talk about... Um, trip two out of pocket. I spent $25 and 52 cents out of pocket. I got back $15 and 60 cents for my Bada. Plus I got, um, 50 cents for the Gatorade, buying two Gatorades, 50 cents for buying two Suaves, 50 cents, um, for June one bonus. I got the $2 midweek moneymaker bonus. I got $1.67 back from Fetch Rewards. So that's like 1,670 points. Um, and then I got a dollar back from Saving Star, making this $3.75 for everything I got, which was actually a good amount of things. And then with my trip, sorry my chair is so squeaky. Um, with trip one and trip two combined, um, since trip one was a money maker and trip two was not quite, uh, but it, with both of them combined so far, I spent a dollar 20 for everything I've shown you. And that's like about 22 items. So not that bad really. And I'm thinking, um, my trip three is going to be pretty good. Plus I'm going to get that $10 cannon bonus cannon cannonball bonus um so yeah it's gonna be super good so look forward for that video friday i think so i'm gonna go shopping tonight it's thursday and i'll record and post on friday but yeah so super good deal if you notice i'm not in my car which i'm kind of excited because with summer coming last summer when i was filming in my car it was miserable um, so I got this backdrop, except the stand for the backdrop did not come. It's coming to day. It should be coming today. Um, or tomorrow. Anyway, so the stand did not come, but I did get the backdrop. So right now it's just like pinned up behind me. Hence like the wrinkles and I haven't done anything. And then I think for the most part, I'll be filming inside. I'm excited about it because 
I like filming in my car, but I always feel like an idiot and I always feel like someone like is walking too closely to me. Um, and plus when I fill my car, I have to go and like write my, adjust any of my breakdown if it was different in the store or something like that. And so I'm always like hunched over over my center console trying to fix that. So now I can come home and figure it all out here. And I'll see you guys, I think Friday with the tail end of this mega haul. You guys have a great Thursday and I will see you guys later.